What is up guys, it's me, Vic Sondry, through with some more Call of Duty Ghost multiplayer gameplay. This is actually some leftover gameplay I captured at the Ghost multiplayer reveal event in LA about three weeks ago. It's some cranked gameplay on Octane, which is a pretty fun, fast-paced map. So anyway, what I thought I'd do is just share the gameplay with you guys and let you know what my plans are for when this game actually comes out. It's not too long now until it does come out. Obviously, it's going to come out on the original consoles first, so I'll be getting it on Xbox 360, then playing it on there for about a week and a half, two weeks, I think it's two weeks, then I'll be picking up the Xbox One and playing on there. Obviously, there won't be a huge difference between the two. I believe we were playing on a PC emulator in this gameplay right here. This is quite an early build. And I've actually played the game twice so far. I played it at the reveal event in LA about three weeks ago, like I said. And I played it in at Gamescom about two weeks ago. I'm going to be playing it again, um, you know, in the next day or two at Eurogamer, which I will be attending all four days of, um, Thursday till Sunday. It's in London. Some of you guys may be going to that if you are. Um, I'll be tweeting whatever I'm up to there. So uh, be cool to meet some of you guys there. Um, always, always good fun. So... Yeah, my plans for when this game comes out is I'm considering doing my usual thing of live commentating my first actual game of playing. However, I've already played the game twice and I'm, I'm going to have played it three times by the time the game actually does come out. So, not too sure if I'm going to go ahead with that. Again, that's something you guys can feed back on. I want to hear what you guys want to see as well because that's equally as important as what I feel like creating. You know, a lot of the reason I create content is for my audience, you guys. So, uh, I'm going to probably... Well, I'm, I'm, I probably will live commentate my first game, whether I post it or not, we will see. And uh, then in the first week, I'm probably going to cover some of the game modes. I'm going to start covering the camos, which should be good fun. I'll be working on a throwing knife montage on the game, which I'll aim to release as soon after Christmas as I'm able to. Um, should actually be able to put plenty more time into that, considering I won't have exams um, come this January time, like I've had the previous two years. So that's going to be... That's going to be a nice release. So I'll be, yeah, working on a throwing knife montage of some sort. We'll have team throwing knife. We'll have the team random weapon gameplays. There's a lot of customization in this game. You know, another huge amount. Um, I think right here in the game, I get cranked out. It's the most frustrating thing ever when that happens. But it does add a really cool element to the game. I really like this game mode. It just keeps it fast paced. You cannot camp on cranked, which is, uh, which is good fun. It's going to definitely bring in some interesting challenges for random weapon gameplays, you know, especially the stuff where we have to rush. It's going to be useful. But yeah, like I say, we're gonna, there's you know plenty in terms of customization. Obviously, you haven't seen that much of it yet. It's all been locked. Hopefully, we'll see a little more in the next few, games at, uh, next few days at Eurogamer, and I'll let you guys know about that in a future video. But right now, um, we don't know a whole lot about the game. I'll also probably be doing a uh, campaign walkthrough on my uh, Vicstar Plays channel, so you guys can also check that out when it's out. At the moment, I'm about halfway through my GTA 5 Let's Play on my uh, Vicstar Plays channel. Seems like a lot of you guys are enjoying that, which is cool to see. Also enjoying doing GTA stuff on this channel. It's just something a bit fresh, and uh, in terms of other games, we've got GTA Online, and we've got the Battlefield 4 beta in about a week, so I'm going to be covering those as well. So there's plenty of good stuff going on, but those are my general plans for um, this game when it does eventually release. We're going to be giving that sort of stuff a go. So uh, it would be cool to hear your feedback on that. And uh, I might even try um, doing some sniping stuff. Because if you guys saw my uh, sniping gameplay I posted about two and a half weeks ago. I actually really enjoyed sniping on this game. It was uh, a lot of fun. So I may may do some sniping stuff as well. We, we shall see. We shall see. Anything could happen. Two other series I'm going to be starting up again for the next game will be my throwing knife tutorial series, you know, bomb spots and that kind of stuff. I'll also be continuing my myth series on this game, testing out interesting stuff in the game. And uh, that's pretty much it. There may be some other unique stuff I, you know, pick up an idea from. When the game does come out, you guys are more than welcome to uh, suggest some stuff like that. In the game right here, I'm just on a tear. Literally, these guys can't even get near me. Got my Riley called in. Every dog on this game is called Riley, right? Um, I, actually, I think right here I get caught out. I was looking for a guy in the mid and then get shot in the back right there. Playing on quite a low sensitivity, actually, when I played on here. I found I did, you know, much prefer playing on a low sensitivity. I believe that's because there was no aim assist on the, uh, or not as much aim assist on the PC build that we were playing. Right here, that should have been a triple spray right there. Probably shouldn't have rushed in on the attack right there, but hey, I head straight back and I, I pick him up. I get him in the end and, uh... Yeah, that's pretty much it for the gameplay. So there we go, some crank gameplay on Octane. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, feel free to leave a like rating 
And uh, let me know what you thought of the game, what you want to see on this game. Check out some more Ghosts videos through the links on screen. And I'll catch you guys in a future video.